I'm, uh, I'm Raymond Simon. I'm from Cape St. George. I was born and raised in Cape St. George. I guess when I was, I say 15, 16, I quit school and then I started working. I went on some jobs when the Americans was working here, the, the Yanks we called them. I had to lie uh, for in order to get in my job, put myself older than I was. I had to lie to get in. So, you know, it wasn't a very good thing to do, but for in order to go to get a job at them times, we wasn't very rich at them times. You know? <laughs> Some people was doing it at my age, so I actually tried it too and it worked. Yeah. So I figured I was just a good worker at 16 and 17, then fellas there 25 and 30. I feel I used to, I used to do my share of work. Yeah. And in some cases, I was better for faster getting around, you know. At them times, yeah. I fished. Fish for a living. In, and in the winter time, I used to work in the woods. Yeah, I work with bow waters, cutting four foot wood, four foot. Stop, and then in the winter time I used to go on the haul off, haul off the horse, you know. Yeah. Then it was finished. I used to come back, come back here and fish, eh? Yeah. And then when they came in with the mechanical logging, then I went working on them. Well, that was a killer. That. Yeah. You uh, was working on wages, and then. After so many cords of wood, he give you a bonus. Well, they had that bonus there to drive you, you see? What, what was there for? Oh, yes, yes, a lot of boys is going to go in the woods in the winter time, yeah. Yeah. But then when I started working in the woods first, that was a year-round job. You could go in, you could go in in the, in the spring and, and used to drive the wood. And then, then to start cut, and then you'll cut. All summer and all the fall until the snow comes, then you haul. When you come back in the spring, you you still drive. But in the spring, I used, I used to come home and fish, fish in the summer. Sometimes it's good and sometimes it's, it's bad. You get bad seasons too. Yeah, but then you know you can go and come whatever you want. There's nobody's telling you what to do. I fish with my dad, and and then when when my dad re retired, I fish with with my brother. So uh, I fished till I was uh, I was 64, and then they came with the the boy out for the boy out the fisherman. Boy. So I took the boy, boy out. Yeah, well, uh, I'm retired from from fishing, but I uh, still works around. I still got a few sheep, uh, and I put up my own gardens, you know. Yeah. That is not there's not too much more, I suppose.